Here's how to fix Android Auto if it's not working. Now, first we'll swipe up from here and tap on the settings icon at the bottom left. The first thing we'll do is tap on connected devices midway down, and then we'll scroll to the very bottom and tap on Android Auto. From Android Auto, of course, tap on connect a vehicle if you haven't already and initiate that connection if you haven't done so already, but I assume that you've already done that. So next we'll tap on start Android Auto automatically. Make sure you, if you tap on that, switch it to either default or switch it to always and it will always initiate the Android Auto when you get in your car. The next thing we'll do is go back out of here and we'll scroll down until we get to the option for apps and tap on that. From apps, let's tap on Android Auto here, the second option in my case, and we'll do a couple of things. We'll tap on permissions and make sure it has all of the necessary permissions. If it's set to not allowed on a lot of different things, just tap on it and switch it to allow while using the app. Now, after we've done that, the next thing we'll do is hit force stop here. And now we'll scroll down and tap on storage. Once we're in the storage, all you're gonna do is clear the cache and clear the data just to reset everything. Now, after you've done all of that, I would recommend hopping out here and just pressing and holding that side button, or you might need to press and hold the volume down and side button, and then just hit the restart button to restart your phone. You might wanna try a software update as well, and you should be good to go.